In this lesson, I want to explain a very simple and easy workflow from pattern design to the render. I explain very fast. In the uh, next lessons, we are going in detail in all of these tools. From beginning, you can hold your mouse over of this icon and the sub menu will be open and we begin with a polygon. I want to design a pattern in a 2D window. From beginning, you can select first from the center, click and then right click. You can activate mirror creation in a Y axis and continue to drawing a pattern here. It's very simple and a snap to each other and click. As you can see, the 2D pattern appear here and it's appear in a 3D view, as you can see. You can select it and make it a little bit closer to the object, the avatar. This is the front side of our t-shirt, for example, and I need the back side. You can go with to transfer pattern tool A to uh, select it, move it. If you move it to the 2D pattern, it does not move in a 3D. Uh, they are individual and they are uh, <coughs> independent from each other. So you can right click and copy. We are explain all of those important settings. You can just copy, right click anywhere and paste mirror. You can paste it in the mirror very easy. It's uh, appearing uh, in the same position. You can uh, use this gizmo for moving the uh, 3D pattern here. Move it to the back of the avatar. As you can see, we have a f back and front. Our pattern here, right click and flip horizontally. As you can see, because in the object, in a, in a class, we have front and back. And you can assign a separate uh, texture for the back and front of your class or fabric. Okay, and it's done. You can go in and swing. Segment swing in a 3D segment swing. Simply click and click in here. It's automatically do for symmetry because it's a symmetry. And click again here and everything is done. It's swing the parts. But before you can go into the 2D and I need to, for example, edit the curve here. I explain all of them. I want to explain to you how easy this software is. And as you can see, we have a curve here. We have a best curve here and another curve here. Okay, that's nice. And here you can select the simulation fast in GPU if you have a heavy uh, class, if you want to normal, but I use an accurate fabric fitting because it's the best. If you, your system is powerful, you can use them. And just click on a simulation and hit a space and everything is done. As you can see there, our t-shirt will be created for us an avatar and you can go back here and edit your pattern click and hold on shift click and drag them both to the down and as you can see and hit the space again and the simulation is activating and you can design your class very fast and here you can turn off the simulation go to the library in a fab Fabric, you can assign any fabric that you want on your uh, model. And after that, you can go in the render and simply click on the render. You can interactive render activate that. And as you can see, you can simply render your avatar interactively. Here, you can assign any fabric to any uh, part of your class if you want. And uh, you can change the background, you can change the size, you can change the lights. I will explain in the next lessons. Uh, I think the last lesson of this training course is rendering. But it's done. As you can see, it's very easy. It's very easy. It's very easy in a Clothier. And it's very uh, interesting. You enjoy when you're using Clothier or Another software of this uh, company is Marvelous Designer. But Color 3D is most complete uh, designing and simulation software for fabric and gloss. That's it. In the next lesson, we are going to the this tool, this tool, this tool, and explain all of them.
Hello my friends, to continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us, and hit the bell icon. And now, you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.